Well, as you drive around the Triangle, you may notice more electric vehicles. And today, hundreds of people came to carry to test drive and view several different models. CBS 17's Ben Boken is digging deeper into the future of the electric vehicle industry here in North Carolina. Dozens of cars driving around in one parking lot would usually sound pretty loud, but it was nearly silent at Sunday's Leith EV Ride and Drive event in Cary, where hundreds came to test and admire the latest electric vehicles. Eric Stevenson was one of them. Two years ago, when I got my first Tesla, I could count how many EVs that I would see, right? Two years later, it's an EV on every corner. With companies like VinFast, which will bring an electric vehicle manufacturing plant to North Carolina, the industry means big business. Business. VinFast will produce around 150,000 electric vehicles each year in Chatham County. Local car dealers think that's just the beginning for EVs in the Tar Heel State. I think I think it's going to be the future. By 2030, we will see a massive increase into the market share of the EV vehicle. We're seeing some of our stores, our Mercedes stores, about 15% of their sales are EVs now, which a year ago was probably two. One of the bigger concerns from customers and car dealers is the distance drivers can travel on one battery charge. But Danny Williams with Leith Automotive Group says the technology and infrastructure is constantly growing. Now, if, if you're a person that goes, you know, out of town, travels for work, and you drive, you know, 150 miles a day, it's probably not, you're probably not ready for an EV yet. According to Leith Cars, there are already almost 700 public charging stations in the Raleigh area alone. Some customers don't think they'll have a choice but to buy in. I really don't think that we're going to have an option. I think the future will definitely be electric. Um, that's what all the governments worldwide are pushing for it. That's what a lot of the manufacturers are dumping billions of dollars into developing. It's a future welcomed by those like Stevenson. I think we're just scratching the surface on this whole EV thing. We're nowhere near uh, the possibilities. Nowhere near. Many EVs can drive between 200 to 300 miles before drivers need to recharge. In Cary, Ben Boken, CBS 17 News.